Divine 22, 7B, 97Z, 50, Quantum, Atomic, Dance, Superfluid, Velocity, UFO, Transport, 5G, while SETI. There's the alien radio signal. And uh, so this is about quantum atomic dance keyword research with superfluid velocity ideas for space travel and computer applications in a UFO found in line 22 wild data. September 13, 2013. Today's October 6. Previous video was line 22, 7B97Z49D. What occurs? Shannon, lithium, cakes, crystals, super lattice formula, 5G, wow, SETI. Quotes and diagrams are from different blogs. This um, is from J. QI.UMD.EDU and it's called quote Geilersberg MD physicist at the Commerce Department National Institute of Standards and Technology NIST have induced thousands of atoms trapped by laser beams to swap spins with partners simultaneously the repeated exchange is like a quantum version of swinging your partner in a square dance but lasting a total of just mil 10 milliseconds might someday carry out logic operations in quantum computers, which theoretically could quickly solve certain problems that today's best supercomputers could not solve in years. Hmm. Interesting. So, there it is there. Uh, let's get two lines there. Get rid of that extra one. Yeah, one one's enough. Quotes and diagrams are from a blog. So this is superfluid velocity in a quantum gas composed of dipoles, I say a BDC of chromium atoms as a function of the density of atoms. Okay. After a certain point, the critical velocity goes down. It's easier for a slowly moving op moving object to feel a drag force. Go here to see movies of an object being dragged through the gas. Solid lines are numerical simulations. Dashed line is a predicted prediction based on Landau's famous criterion. With Mike Cavaniero and Chris Ticknor, we have, sh have have shown that all dipolar molecules will scatter elastically with pretty much the same cross-section at low temperatures if you scale things appropriately. Here's a cross-section collision energy, numerical solution Born approximation, and a conal approximation. So the figure is scattering cross-section versus collision energy for elastic scattering of dipoles at low temperature. <coughs> Excuse me. Quotes from a blog. Both quantities are expressed in natural units for dipoles. Mm. Numerical result: black. A well approximated. Okay, so in the black, that's the middle line there. Um, numerical results: black are well approximated by the Born approximation at really low energy, which is blue, and this is the really low energy up here. And it says, and by the conal approximation at low, but not quite as low energies, which is red. So it just goes veers off a bit in the red. In between, scattering will depend on details beyond the molecule's dipole moments. Quotes from a blog. Question. What happens when two Bose einstein condensates form at the same time in the same trapped environment? And what happens if they're made of different atoms and if the atoms are strongly repel one another? Answer. The two condensates separate, making layers of bubbles. Shea Ronan, along with Laura Halmo and Mark Edwards at Georgia Southern University, have simulated this using a surprisingly simple yet instructive model to see the dynamics in action. Click the picture below. And of course, it doesn't work for me. So that's what it looks like. The separation of dual species. I think bose einstein condensate into interleaving layers, the density of RB85 left and RB87 on the right have been separated into two frames to more easily distinguish them. So you can see the difference. There's like a little thing here and then this one has that. Uh, you stick them together, they all go together, right? Clip the picture for animations of the formulation of these layers. Okay, so this is grizzly.colorado.edu is the website where I found it. Okay. September 13, Errol, UFO Roswell, Mexico, USA, 1947. This is what she says to do. Apply this separation of dual species bosi einstein constant algorithms shown in the data above to the atomic dance quantum physics experiments and see what happens. Okay. 
to get that. So you want to take these this data here and apply it to your quantum dance uh, technology. And the keyword the sync function will be in the next video. Thanks for watching. And if you do do this experiment, please blog it so we can find it and look at it. Thanks.